Examining countries where the government is poor, but the people are relatively wealthy involves exploring complex socio-economic dynamics. These scenarios often arise due to factors such as natural resource wealth, informal economies, remittances from abroad, or historical contexts. Here is a detailed look at 10 countries where such a paradox exists. Number 10. Pakistan. Pakistan's government faces numerous challenges, including corruption, debt, and inadequate public services. Nonetheless, there is a substantial affluent population, particularly in urban centers like Karachi, Lahore, and Islamabad. These individuals have accumulated wealth through business, industry, and remittances from the large Pakistani diaspora, particularly in the Middle East, Europe, and North America. Number 9. Haiti. Haiti is one of the poorest countries in the Western Hemisphere, with the government struggling to provide basic services. However, there is a small wealthy elite, often with ties to business, international aid, and remittances from the Haitian diaspora in the United States, Canada, and France. These remittances play a crucial role in supporting many Haitian families, contributing to a disparity between the general population and the wealthy minority. Number 8. Russia. Russia, despite its vast natural resources, faces government inefficiencies and corruption. A significant portion of the Russian population, particularly in Moscow and St. Petersburg, enjoys considerable wealth due to private enterprises, natural resource exploitation, and foreign investments. The oligarchic system that emerged post-Soviet Union has led to the concentration of wealth among a small, powerful group. Number 7. Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan's government, despite its oil and mineral wealth, struggles with corruption and unequal wealth distribution. Many Kazakhs, especially those in urban centers and involved in the oil and gas industry, live relatively affluent lives. The country's rich natural resources benefit a segment of the population connected to these industries, even though the public sector faces challenges. Number 6. Egypt. Egypt's government deals with substantial economic challenges, including high debt and poor public services. However, a significant number of Egyptians, especially those in urban areas like Cairo and Alexandria, have accumulated wealth through business, tourism, and trade. Remittances from Egyptians working abroad, particularly in the Gulf countries, also contribute significantly to household incomes. Number 5. Iraq. Post-war Iraq faces significant challenges, including corruption, a weak public sector, and ongoing conflict. Despite this, many Iraqis, particularly those involved in the oil industry, business, and trade, enjoy substantial wealth. The Kurdish region in the north, with its semi-autonomous government, also experiences relatively higher living standards due to oil revenue and better governance compared to the rest of the country. Number 4. Libya. Libya's government has been in turmoil since the fall of Muammar Gaddafi, leading to fragmented control and a struggling public sector. However, wealth remains among those connected to the oil industry, which continues to be a significant source of revenue. Tribal affiliations and regional disparities also contribute to the wealth distribution, with some regions being more prosperous than others. Number 3. Venezuela. Venezuela has faced severe economic mismanagement, leading to hyperinflation and a collapsing public sector. Despite this, some Venezuelans remain wealthy, especially those with ties to the former or current government, or those involved in the black market and foreign trade. Additionally, Venezuelans who have assets abroad or receive remittances from family members living in other countries manage to maintain higher living standards. Number 2. Nigeria. Nigeria's government often grapples with corruption, poor infrastructure, and inadequate public services despite being Africa's largest oil producer. However, a substantial segment of the Nigerian population, particularly those involved in the oil industry, business, and entrepreneurship, enjoys considerable wealth. The country's informal economy, which includes small-scale trade and services, also supports many families. Number 1. Lebanon. Lebanon has experienced severe economic challenges, especially in recent years, with the government struggling with debt and financial instability. However, many Lebanese citizens maintain relatively high living standards due to significant remittances from the large Lebanese diaspora, 
particularly in the Gulf countries, the Americas, and Africa. The private sector, including banking and real estate, also plays a crucial role in sustaining the wealth of individuals.